everybody, Tracy Hackler, joined by Carlos Torres, and this is an exciting edition of Panini Unwrapped because we have the landmark, the historic 20th edition of Contenders Football, 2012 Contenders Football, Carlos. Very excited, Tracy, very is, excited. Now, I know this looks like a regular size box, but it's actually not, it's actually a house. It's a home that houses rookie cards, autograph rookie cards. It's the home of the autograph rookie card. Yep. It's a long way to get to that one. Um, now, we opened a box yesterday for the nice line. It's a little mm -hmm. one box teaser. And the box, we, you can't help but note the box has five autographs per box. Yes. The, the box we haven't opened had six. You will get six per box. Oh, okay. So there's a, like an added autograph. Um, so the things that collectors have come to expect, appreciate, admire about contenders is obviously the autograph rookie cards. Yes. The, uh, the, the potential of a lot of the guys who, who may not seem like household names now or star rookies, their, their rookie autographs are in here and down the road we've seen these some of these guys called Skyrocket. Tom Brady yeah. comes to mind. A guy like Kurt Warner comes to mind. Um, Kaepernick. Colin Kaepernick comes to mind. So many examples of this phenomenon. And so when people don't pull the luck or the RG3 or the Russell Wilson, there's there uh, sometimes is a sense that, oh, man, I didn't get what I – but you – you keep that same card in your box, and you, two years or three years from now, you go back through them and you can see the appreciation. So, yes. Another thing collectors have come to expect from contenders are the rookie uh, variations. Now, last year created quite a buzz because of the real minute differences. So, uh, a couple of questions Are there rookie variations this year? That's one question. Oh, yes. Okay. Um, and. Are they more noticeable? Are the variations more discernible this year than last year? Yes. From like one very one player has two cards. Are they easily discernible? Yes. Okay. It's photo on front. Photo on front, completely different photo, and then um, I guess how, how do you know which one is the variation and which one isn't? Like which one is the SP? Like how do you know that? Yes. <laughs> Um, okay. Yes. Yes. Huh. Okay. Well, maybe we'll keep uh, plugging along and see what you got. James Hanna, rookie he, ticket. You know where he's from? Flower Mound. Flower Mound. Played in Oklahoma. You know where I live? Flower Mound. Flower Mound. You know where Chris Reed, the guy behind the camera, lives? Flower, Flower Mound. Mound. You know where Tone Stakes over at Acquisitions lives? Flower Mound? Yes, Isaiah Peed. Isaiah Peed. Talented running back for the St. Louis Rams. Very nice. Uh, on card autograph, rookie, RPS rookie ticket. Rookie Stallion. Yeah, how can we say that? And Ronnie Stallion. Hillman? Yeah. Oh, what are you looking at back there? Huh? What are you looking at the back of it for? Seeing uh, what card number it was. Card number 213. 213. Carlos. Calvin Johnson Jr. Steven Jackson. Oh, this, this is a great those are, insert. Those are some nice inserts there. A legendary champions, Greg Jennings from Super Bowl 45. Great photography. Classy. Some of the greatest performances in uh, Super Bowl history chronicled on this insert. One the MVP contender. Yes. He's not the he's MVP, a though. He's not a contender. Um, He's a champion. Um, one thing I was going to ask you: legendary champions. Is that does that replace? Is that legendary contenders or no? No. Okay. There's still autos of the retired guys in here. Okay. Very limited too. They Very are, right? limited. They're hard to pull. Oh, I got a, I got a, a uh, I got a playoff ticket autograph. I saw it. There's ah. Torrey Smith. There's. Zach Brown. Very nice. He doesn't, not the Zach Brown of the Zach Brown band. This is the extremely talented linebacker from the Titans who near the end of the season had a two touchdown game, I believe. Mm -hmm. And this is numbered on the back and it's numbered 41 of 99. Here's a nice insert. Rookie of the Contenders. Nice. No longer contender. Right. It is, uh, Who is the rookie of the year? RG3. RG3, the greatness of RG3. The uh, variations are only available 
in the C2S version, not the full version. Okay, so only available in the base version? Yes. Here's a guy who got kind of a raw end of the deal this year, but he's going to be back. Oh yeah, he's going to be back. I got a, a rookie stallion, Kendall Wright. Speedy, Very nice. big play threat out of Tennessee, and then I had to show out of Baylor. the guy who succeeded Tim Tebow in Denver, the great Peyton Manning, who also, speaking of your MVP contender, was an MVP contender. Yep, comeback player of the year. Oh, this is... Is this one of Richard Sherman's first base cards this year? I believe so, yes. What is up? Check that out. Brandon Taylor. Nice. Safety out of uh, San Diego. There's four autos right there so far. Oh, it's another one. Okay. Cool. Oh, Terrence Ganaway. St. Louis. Rookie running back. Started with the Jets, I think, this year. Mm-hmm. Okay. Here's uh, Marcus Allen, legendary champions. Oh yes. Uh, I'm glad. I'm so glad we pulled this. So apropos that <laughs> we pulled the MVP contenders of Peyton Manning. We're just talking about him. Very nice. I should have. I should have waited until I pulled that card to bring him up. But sometimes you get so excited, you just can't wait. Bro. Exactly. I've already it's my last pack here. Are you really? I'm blown through it. Nice. All right. Rookie Stallion, Nick Perry, linebacker from Green Bay. He's a big time player, man. He is. MVP he fits well in that system. Shady McCoy. Very nice. To be back and healthy for another great year. And there are gold and black versions of yes. MVP? Yes, there are. And then uh, uh, Richie Stallions, there's gold versions? Yes. And in Legendary Champions, there's also gold versions, correct? Yes, sir. There's Joe Flacco, there's a guy, guy who had a good little postseason. Had a good little postseason run. Yep. Here's a Keyshawn Martin autograph. Keyshawn was uh, very nice. He got some production this last year. Yes, he did. Here, why don't you open that one? We'll just Two four. There's, a, there's a six autographs right there. Six autos. You got a P, Isaiah P. There's our rookie of the year contenders, Robert Turbin. Legendary champion of one San Antonio Holmes. Oh, yes. Was he in or was he out? I think he was out. I think he was out. But no one asked me. I also think there was a conspiracy on the grassy knoll. But I mean, that's another topic for another day. Yeah. <laughs> this is about contender, and that is one one box. We got six autographs instead of the the alluded to five. We got the Isaiah Pete on card. We got the the playoff ticket parallel version, which are pretty tough. Mm -hmm. And. There are variations. I saw you looking at the backs of these cards, and I don't think you were looking for numbers. So I, I'm going to explore that a little closer and see see if I can. I don't know what you were looking for, but I know you were looking card for card numbers. See what card number I have. I don't believe you. Chicken collation. Don't believe you, because you would have done that in the QC process. I did do that in QC process. So I'm going to look, explore the backs of these a little bit closer and see what I can find out. Uh, so we're going to give some of these away. Absolutely. We got a few boxes we're going to give away as well. Um, so stay tuned to find out how to how to win them. We love you, Carlos. Thanks for coming on. No problem. Thanks for having me. Too. Oh, you're welcome. But I love you guys and gals. And thanks for watching. Enjoy, guys. Enjoy. We'll see you. Ah!